Bye, guys. Bye. I came to crash the party. Actually, I came to do the party. <laughs> I didn't give any notice. I just popped on. I'm going to fill up my piping bag with some spackle while you guys find me. Hi, Denise. Thanks for joining me, friend, with a surprise live. Hi, right now. I think this is the bag I want. I think. Oh. Love me. Stop trying to deny the nest. <laughs> Hi, Stephanie. Hi, Pit Boss. Hi, Mary. How are you guys? Surprise, surprise. I'm interrupting dinner. I don't have a whole lot of time. <laughs> My dog's over me being down here. Hi, Ivy. How are you? What's everybody up to? It's dinner time, right? Hi, Amy. Sorry, making a lot of making a lot of ruckus over here. What's up? What's happening, hot stuffs? I have something on my phone, and it looks like I have spackle in my hair, which I usually do. So, hi, Albert. Oh, I'm sorry, Ivy. I'll send you a big squeeze. Hi, Deborah. What's up, guys? I hope you guys are all having a good Wednesday. If you're not, I'm sorry. It was a beautiful day today in beautiful Illinois. <laughs> What's going on with my hair? Hi, Sarah. Hi, Chris. Thanks for joining, guys. It's no notice. I am... I was going to do this for a quick video, but I'm like, I haven't seen you guys. I haven't been on. I want to come say hi to my friends. We're not going to be super long. I won't keep you all long. Um, but it's day 13. And I was supposed to come hang out with you guys on Monday, and I didn't because we were so busy every day. Um, you know, Monday's Babe's Babe's Day for his live, and we were both just so busy. I was like, oh my god, I didn't even um, tell our friends we weren't going on your live, babe. <laughs> Thank you for sprinkling. I'm doing well, Raina. It was a beautiful, beautiful day. Um, and I got out of the basement because I had errands to do. And then we were live over in the group. And now my dog's over it. Thank you for sprinkling. I, well, girl, you know me. <laughs> I'm going to start using spackle to get my hair up. <laughs> so I wanted to do, I don't know if you guys noticed, I just posted a shake it was yesterday's video. I did the gingerbread with the chocolate chip cookies because I love that jar. I wanted to make a shake. This is going to be a shake version of our um, big star design that we did in our group. And then I did the star cone with you guys. I'm actually going to grab my whirly twirlies that I made over there off my tray. Hang on. And we're going to put those inside of my shake. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hold the phone. Try and grab all the things. I need bigger hands. I wanted to get my stocks. <laughs> Thank you for sprinkling, guys. Hi, Tisha. Welcome, welcome. So if you guys are missing that content that's going up on the page every single day, we are doing a 30-day challenge. Um, I am picking names additional for 
um, winners that are sprinkling that content, you know, it's going to be separate from the name I pick for sprinkling my live. So my stuff's in the way. Yeah, I got my piles and piles of clay, but I don't need my clay. So I'm already clayed out. <laughs> so I'm going to figure out where I want my front. I already have my gaps and cracks, um, scrap foam. You guys can do anything inside your glasses. I like to have foam because I always run some skewers or dowels through this. So I don't mess around with that foam board paper towel stuff. I don't do that. If you guys are doing very little dainty lightweight things in a shape, you can totally do that. I know not everybody messes with gaps and cracks. I use it for everything. So, oh, hi, Nellie. <laughs> don't worry about it, girlfriend. So thank you for sprinkling. I already got my stars. You know, I love my stars. I love my stars. I love my stars. And of course, I'm gonna put a little gingy in there. She's dry. <laughs> Hi, Alyssa. How are you? So I'm gonna run some super glue. I'm going to be using my little kebabs. I don't need anything fancy for this because I'm going to be covering that with spackles. So you're not going to see any fancy straw or any of that. So what I like to do, I know you guys have seen me do many, many, many of these. I think I got my, um, but wait, there's more mix in my glass. I think that, that, that's going to be my room. What's that, Ivy? The spackle? <laughs> Girl, I'm a mess. And I buy that big bottle. I'm trying to see how I want this. All right. We're going in. I just made these, so they are fresh. I do recommend you letting your clay dry. I've done enough of these. I know how I work with spackle. Um, so I, I, I can get away with it. But I definitely recommend you want your stuff. You want your stuff, typically, you want your clay dry. Because when our clay dries, it shrinks. And so does our spackle. So you don't want any spaces when you got your shrinkage. I, I think I got this down, <laughs> so I, I cheat, and I and I just do it, <laughs> Lisa. It's okay. So I always like to get my main event in my shake first because I want this, you know, I want this in the glue. And I'm going to show you guys something I don't think you guys always catch in my videos. All right, this is going to be a really good example because I got that gaps and cracks. It's not, can you see my table? Hi, Tasha. The spackle is sticky, Ivy. All right, hold the phone. I'm jumping ahead of myself. Let me line my stars out because I want to see how much room I have. I got to get this gingerbread in. You know I will. Girl, you know I will. All right, that looks good. I'm going to glue this in. <clears throat> so I like to line everything up and eyeball my placement. All right, so, okay, we, we are not going to sit here for 20 minutes holding this thing so it dries because look where it goes. So, you know, I always have some scrap styrofoam around. I use them as shims. So I'm going to take this. I'm going to put a little more glue on the back of my stick and on that foam, and I'm going to shim that bad boy up. Now, I don't care if it hangs over my glass a little bit, <clears throat> because I'm going to cover it with spackle anyway. You're not going to see it. Okay, and then that's going to hold that in place. I know it looks silly, but it works, guys. I'm going to shim that bad boy up. I don't know if I'm going to glue this one in. Yeah, I'm gonna. I 
light. Hi, Ellen. Sound like I said Ellen. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hi, Helen. <laughs> I want my super glue. Hi, Rosie. How are you, girlfriend? Time is just going too fast. I just, I can't. I need more time. And then we lost that hour. Time's never on our side. Especially those of you that try to have to work <laughs> and craft. All right, I'm going to line this baby up. I'm going to see where I want her. I want to make sure I got room for my baby girl. My gingerbread, not Gianna. <laughs> Gianna's my baby girl. All right, that looks good. I'm going to hot glue that bad boy in there. I'll turn this around. Oh, that one's going to sit good. Because we got her off to the side. So it doesn't need a shim. So if you guys get this on here and you're like, oh my God, I'm not exp extending my spackle that far. Wait till it's completely dry. Take your scissors. It's styrofoam. You could just smush it or you could just lop it off. I know I'm going to be dragging it all out. <clears throat> Oh, I know, Helen, you do amazing. Hi, Ginger Pony. Pony, 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 pony. <laughs> I actually think I have one of your pieces from one of my friends. It's a gorgeous. Oh, awesome, Josie. I know I'm a lot. I'm a lot. I don't mind being a lot. Someone's got to be a lot. I'm going to be a lot. I know I'm an acquired taste, <laughs> but I'm always going to be myself here. All right, so when I spackle my glasses, thank you, and I appreciate that. And I'm glad, because sometimes I can't spoke, I'm glad that you're learning all the things, especially for our newbies, because sometimes I get to yapping and I'm all over the place, like I just did right now. Hi, Deb. Okay, so whenever I do my spackle, this is how I'm doing my setup, okay, for a base like this. i got secrets that I can't share here. But um, for a base like this, to build these shapes, I always start in the back. I'm going to hide my mechanics, and I'm going to give myself a base of spackle. I'm going to worry about dropping my spackle after I get a base. So this is what my back looks like. I'm just covering that stuff. There's more. You know... There's more. Can you slow down? I'm not going to be here long. <laughs> this bucket of spackle that I bought. All right, so I'm just starting with the base. I'm not leaving my spackle like that. You know I'm not. I'm going to go in and I'm going to cover the rest of my skewers. And my styrofoam. Okay. Now, I want to drop that. I never go straight around with my piping. I like to drop something. I don't want mine all straight and even. And you guys, I'm not doing any fancy spackling. I'm literally making circles. You might be surprised to learn that if you ask me to go round and round and make a basic cupcake, I don't do it nice. I don't do it nice. My spackle just burped in my face. I always give my embellishments in the back a hug with that with that spackle. All right, I'm going to go in with my next biggest star. Yes, Josie, I always pipe my shakes and stuff like this with a 1M. Hi, Laura. Hi, Quincy. Hi, Kathy. Sorry if I missed. I was in the zone. All right, so this one's not going to go through my styrofoam. If you want yours to, of course, you can glue it in. That third one, I like to wait. I like to get pretty much my two biggest embellishments glued into my styrofoam before I start building around it because it may seem 
when I glue everything in, like, oh, I'm not going to have enough room. But all of a sudden, our base gets bigger as we are adding, like, look at how much more room I have now. So I don't necessarily need these smaller guys to be run through my styrofoam and glued in. If you want to, and you want to start your base with your whipped cream, and then you want to go in and add this, but you don't want to just rely on the spackle, I get it. I don't like doing that either. So what you could do is get it lined up. Let me, let me show you guys. Hi, Eileen. What's up, girlfriend? All right, I'm going to pre-drill this. You guys, I'm working with fresh clay here. I'm going to get my super glue. Guys, don't use hot glue on fresh clay. Don't use it on foam clay at all. Just don't. Stop it. Stop doing that. Unless you're making it for yourself. <laughs> then, then go for it. But All right, I know I don't need this much. So I'm going to show you something. So you can line up where you think you want this. And then you could mark down... And you're not going to be able to see it on camera. You can mark down a hole into your spackle. Then you can take your other skewer. You can pre-drill that hole. Get it good in there. Okay? So you got a nice hole in there. We're through our gaps and cracks. Then you can put your hot glue on here and get it right in there. <laughs> get it right in there. Okay? I don't like doing it. I've done it, but when I miss that hole and that hot glue grabs my spackle, I just got a big mess over here. So I, I'm going to do it to show you guys. I just want to make sure that I got that where I want it. Now I could tell that my styrofoam, my star is going to be leaning forward. So I'm going to go back in with my skewer here and I'm going to push that styrofoam I'm going to widen it backwards. Then I can go in, get spackle all over my table and myself. You guys, this is how I learned to do shapes. I just had a fiddle and fart with everything. All right, now I got that where I want it. So I need to go under there and hide my mechanics. I am. Hi, Ursula. You guys, it's in the hair. <laughs> I told you I was bringing a party. <laughs> Sorry if you guys are new to my page and you're like, what is this disaster? I might be a disaster, but you know what? I'm going to give you a tip or two. <laughs> I promise, you learned something. All right. Where are you going? Okay. Now I got my little girl. <laughs> I know, right? Yes. What's up, Jennifer? How are you, girl? Hi, friend. All right, I'm going to get my baby girl in here. I'm going to use a toothpick. Now, when I make my gingerbread, there's a toothpick already in her body. So I have to be mindful. I feel it. I don't want to rip her head off. So I'm going to I'm going to wiggle that around so that I'm not running this toothpick right through her and knocking her head off. I don't rely on spackle and clay to hold my designs together. Guys, take that extra time, especially if you guys sell. Make it nice. Make it happy. I'm going to get her in there. I'm going to wiggle her little butt right in that spackle. I like that toothpick there because that it's just not the clay sitting on the spackle. Okay? Okay, guys? Hi, Carly. Thank you, Nadine. We're not done. You know we're not done. Now, I might do this. I got a couple little purple stars. I want some pops of purple. I don't know where I'm going to put them. I may add this to my straw. I don't know. Let's just see what happens. 
All right, I'm gonna build that spackle up behind my yellow star and I'm gonna get it in. I'm gonna get it in over here and then I have two smaller ones. I'm gonna get this guy in and then this little bitty is gonna be between our gingerbread. She's gonna, she's gonna hold that, but wait, there's more. Yes, Rosie, I just don't have Messenger on my business page. So you have to find me on my personal page. I want to put my spring of dings in. Okay. All right. I might have to grab. I know I'm going to have to. I could feel it. I'm going to have to geez, add um, <laughs> some more spaggled words. I'm going to have to get more spackle in my bag. And that's when it really burps on me. All right, I got fresh clay here. I'm not going to worry about running uh, glue through this, okay? I'm not going to worry about it. I just got a toothpick here. This is just one, uh, like one, one piece of clay. It's not layered like these macaron style. All right, I want this just a smidge higher. Hang on, hold the phone. Cute. D, that's so cute. <laughs> spring a ding. Spring a ding. It's just clay. I just rolled out like a snake, thin snake, and I just wrapped it around loosely onto a dowel. When I did it live, it did not work out. <laughs> so I was looking for something silicone. Like if you have a silicone straw, boom, do it. Um, I know a lot of people like to put oil and stuff on their clay. I, I don't. So y'all do what you want. And then they're like my hair when I don't straighten it. So I'm going to get these in here. You know I am. All right. Since most of this is going to go down into my spackle, I am going to run a toothpick through my springy dings because you're not going to see it. Okay, you're not going to see that. That's going to be, it is wacky. I'm wacky. I got to have wacky designs. I'm going to glue this in. I don't know why. It's going to be in spackle, but just what I do. It's just what I do. I don't know which one I have. I'm going to cut this bad boy. I'm going to run it right down there. I want it in there enough to where it's covering my spackle. Or, it's covering the toothpick. I could see it. i got to trim this down. Uh, it's a party! Up in here, up in here. Hello, Nicholas. What happened to my stars on Etsy? What? What stars? What? 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 I don't know. I don't know what you're asking, Cheryl. I got a whole lot of stars over there. <laughs> I got star sprinkles. I got me a big star design. I, I don't know. All right, I want this one high. I'm trying to offset my colors. So I only have one pink spring a ding a ding. Spring ding dong. Spring a ding 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 dong. <laughs> Hi, Anne. Ivy, what, what are you asking about? 
the spring of dinglings. <laughs> I did that a couple weeks ago when we made that star cone. But they, I totally failed on the live. It came out real cute until I went live. Spring of ding a ding 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 boop boop. What's up, Heather? Guys, I was bullied to come live today. I'm kidding. <laughs> Cheryl, what are you talking about? The sprinkles? I got them. Um, I'll check the listing, but girl, I just relisted. I restocked all of my sprinkles. I have pastel stars. I have the multicolor stars, and I have the patriotic stars. Now, I've done this before where I accidentally didn't fill in my quantities. So, there might be one quantity and then it sells and then poof, the listing's gone. That may have happened. I don't think so, but I will look for you. But everything's restocked. That Candyland mix, my but wait, there's more mix. Patriotic, there's everything is there, guys. But I will look, Cheryl, and I'm sorry if that's, if that's what I did. I'm a mess, guys. I don't know. All right, I'm going to do pink on this side, and I'm going to bring my little turquoise color down here. So I'm going to get my pink somewhere in here. I still got my other star to get in here. You know I'm going to get it in. You know I'm going to get it in. Welcome to the page of more and more. When you think I'm done? No. There's always more. Oh, that we did in group. I will check that, Cheryl. I will check that for you. Sorry. Nike, Nike's had enough. All right. I think I'm going to do this little spring a ding ling <laughs> A little different. I think I'm going to get it right up in my spot. Look at her. Oh, Quincy, don't ask me. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Cottontail Candy Company. Chocolate and jelly beans. Yay, Ness, I did it. I did it. <laughs> this for my girl, Amber, over at Crazy Craft and Mama. Go check her out, guys. She does all my tumblers, most of my clothes now. <laughs> I know, right? She's like, enough. There's people outside, Mom. Get your butt up here and save me. All right, I want to get some twists in. You know what I do. I don't know where. But I'm going to get them in. I'm no quitter. I'm going to keep going. <laughs> All right, I just want a little piece of this. Hang on, I forgot this little spring of a dang. Oh, I don't like that. I have them going the same way. Hang on. Let me move my body. Move my body. <laughs> I got problems. Hi, Renee. All right. I need to get a little more spackle up in my, in my busy bag. Because you know what I'm talking about. I don't like refilling these, especially when I'm live, <laughs> because they burp all over, I spackle up in my hair, <coughs> everywhere. And then I move my stuff's over. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Feather. You know I love missing stars. <laughs> Shh! Your music and shenanigans. More. Give me, give me more. Give me more. <laughs> Hi, 
whether I read your comment is, I didn't see you get here. <laughs> Those of you that actually stick through a whole lot with me, you're amazing. <laughs> I'm a lot. Hi, Misty. All right, guys, let me rinse my hands really fast. My sink's right here. Oh, my Cujo up there. Whenever she's barking like that, I'm like, what would you do anyway? Like, really, what would you do? Nothing. I'm not going to do nothing. She's all bark and no bite. She up there talking smack. Alright, so right between my gingerbread, I don't like the way the star will sit in front of her. I don't want this to burp all over my gingerbread. So let me do a little something. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Eliza. Hi, Lindsay. Don't burp on my gingerbread. All right, I need to build that spackle up. Otherwise, this star is going to look lost on her. Such a messy craft. Somebody's got to do it. I will show you. Don't get mad at me yet. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this bad boy in here. I'm gonna get this big old twist in here. I'm gonna put a hole in the back of it. I'm gonna get me some super glue. You guys, it was actually hot today. Like I was hot. I had a sweatshirt on. I took it off. It never happens. I'm always freezing. <laughs> Rosie, that's not that's not everybody. <laughs> I'm annoying. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kat. Of course. We gotta share with our friends, guys. You know, this craft um really did something for me. And I like to be able to share all the things because it's like sharing joy, you know? There's not enough of it, so we gotta make it spread. All right, I'm gonna get this in. I'm gonna get it in. Family's blowing up my phone. My daughter's coming home from Arizona tonight. She's so excited. She gets homesick. She said um, the other night, she's like, I just feel like a toddler. I just want my mommy. <laughs> she go be 23. I said, I can never imagine <laughs> going somewhere and like wanting to go home to see my mom. <laughs> she's like, well, I love my mommy. Oh, we do? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I pay no attention. I just do, I do what I do. I'm just in my own little community over here. That's how I like things. I definitely uh, beat to my own drum. Can you hear Cujo? All right, I always put skewers through my straws. I'm not gonna rely on Spackle over time to just have this little. Ooh, that's a ferocious. I'm really mad. <laughs> I feel sorry for that guy out there. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Hi, Willie. Hi, Dewey. How are you? All right, I got. I don't know where this came from, but look, it's got stars on it. You know I'm gonna use it. I'm not gonna get it. I'm not done, guys. Still got a sprinkle. 
Nike needs to calm herself. Mama got, Mama got stuffs to finish. You know what, guys? I see a little bit of my toothpick on here. I don't like that. Hang on. All right. I want to go behind my gingerbread and bring up my whipped cream. I need to do this carefully, so I'm going to hold myself. I don't want to bump her. Ooh. Alright, I just want to go around. I like to make sure that I see a hole right here. My The back of my shape looks flat. So, I don't want that. So, I just go around and I circle it up. I don't want it flat. And it looks like me. <laughs> From the back. <laughs> okay, boom. Now we need sprinkles. Vanessa, where's your tray? Okay. Since I have my butt weight, there's more mix inside my glass. I'm going to use it all around. This is back in my shop. Rosie, I have scaled my shakes down over the last like year and a half. But they used to be really big. <laughs> I haven't done a really big one in a very long time. All right, I'm going to take a little bit of my water because I'm fiddling and farting. I want my sprinkles to stick. This is just a little, I'm going to keep it off my gingerbread even though my clay is dry. This is how I'm going to get my stuff to stick. <laughs> hey, yo, can you fill my sprinkles for me? That was so funny, you guys. It is, Peggy. You remember my shakes. <laughs> I'm getting cold now that I said that. Hang on. Start spraying water and washing my hands. And now I got the chilly willies. What's happening there? So when I sell these, and they are dry completely. Like, I'll go in and I could obviously see. You need a little push. Um, but obviously, a lot the way I have put my sprinkles on, I'm not pulling out a tweezer. Stop. <laughs> I um, turn my shakes upside down. I knock off anything loose. Obviously, when these are dry. You have a lot of them, Ginger Pulley. <laughs> You. you don't have a few of anything of mine. <laughs> you got more and more, baby. More and more. All right. So now, because I have all my stuff glued, secured, insured, I can do that. I can hold it this way, that way. It's not going to go anywhere. I ain't worried about it. So when all this dries... I let my stuff dry for 10 days, my spackle, before I ship anything. So when I'm ready to take this over to my shipping table and ship it, I turn it upside down. Anything, like, see where those sprinkles fell in between my gingerbread, that star? It's not touching anything. It's just sitting there. But I don't want to touch it. I want to let this dry, and then I will turn it upside down and knock all the loose stuff off. I'm not done. I have not put my signature on it. I mean, I guess I have because I got the stars on here. But <laughs> I know we need one right now. All right, so tripping over my clay. I always finish the footing of my glass. This is how I sign my art. I'm going to take one of these. It doesn't have purple in it like the other two, but it's fine. It's got the colors. This is where you guys can unload some of those cabochons that we all buy and never use. If you don't have something that you want to get in there with clay. Again, it's going to have a grabber.
Hi, Terry. Welcome, welcome. I'm Vanessa with Up and Growing, if anybody's new here. You showed up to the mess. Thank you, Amber. All right. Again, I know I got extra sitting there. I don't want to push everything in because I'm going to lose the prettiness of my spackle. So whatever sticks, sticks. And then I will turn it upside down. Look at me pulling my spackle. Hang on. Hold the phone. I got I gotta repair this. Okay. Well, if I was basic <laughs> and just did this like a normal person would. But I'm not vanilla. I gotta bring it all down. It's just what I like to do, guys. There's nothing wrong with it. <laughs> I'm just playing. Oh no. That 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 could be a whole process, right, Heather? Right, I'm not gonna put this away. I'm gonna show you guys this one more time. I'm gonna scoot upstairs. Make sure my dog's okay. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know if you could see, but I did glitter my my stars. Just cute, right? Now, if I was one to decorate with a whole lot of fake fakes, they would be all like this. <laughs> there would be all the star designs and the cookie designs that I do. They are my favorite. I love them. Boop, 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 boop. Thank you, guys. That's all I got for you today. That's probably all you can handle. Because <laughs> I'm a lot. <laughs> I know I am. Aw, hi, crew. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> hi, Marissa. Yeah, we just finished. We just finished this big in. This big in. It's not big for me, but I know it is. I know, I know it is. It's your normal size shake. <laughs> Aw, we love you, crew. We talk about you every day. Every day, every day we're talking about you. You're the coolest kid ever. Thank you, Marissa. Thank you, Janet. So, um, I felt like I lied to you last time. I usually don't say when I'm going to be live, and I did, <laughs> and then I wasn't. I don't like saying when I'm coming live because... My family will always be first. Life happens, things happen, and sometimes I just don't want to. <laughs> so I apologize that I did that. I'm not going to do that anymore. I will just be here when I'm here, and sometimes I'll give you a little notice that I'm coming live, and most of the time it's just a surprise. So he is the best. He's the coolest kid ever. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. I'm excited to see my daughter. I might hang out with her tomorrow if she wants. I don't know. <laughs> she goes back to work Friday. We'll see what happens. You are very welcome. Thanks for hanging out with no notice and doing all the things. And I will see you guys soon. If I'm not here, there's going to be content on the page. So if you guys want to be sprinkling that stuff out. I am doing a separate box, um, a surprise box for the sprinkles on that content. And then of course, different for my live. All right, guys, you enjoy the rest of the, the day. I don't even know what time it is anymore. So <laughs> I will see you guys soon. Bye guys. Thank you.